The typical process of closing the day is done in the operations daily close screen where you view your receipts in the proof edit receipt section and then enter your values under step one. However, with the proliferation of online payments, a situation arises in terms of reconciliation where you may close the day, for example, at 6 p.m. in the evening, but you have payments that potentially continue on throughout the night. So, for example, you close the day at 6 o'clock, a payment from your online website comes in at 11 p.m. You obviously are not there to close the day again. What happens is, you have that payment showing on that day's receipts, but it's not on that day's close because it happened after the close at 6 p.m. It is then going to be on the following day's close. So there's a opportunity for differences between your receipts and your deposits because of this scenario. When that question comes into support or when that situation arises, the recommendation would be to set up an auto daily close. Now this auto daily close is not meant to replace your close that you're doing at six o'clock. This is meant to be in addition to that close. Therefore, you will have a second close that evening. Once that's done, in terms of your management summary report, amongst other reports, but specifically the management summary, when we look at the receipt section versus deposits, when we have this second auto close that's happening at midnight, your receipts will match your deposits every single time. So when you come from a standpoint of your receipts always matching your deposits, it becomes a lot easier to reconcile. There's the deposit section at the top. Here's the receipt section at the bottom. Your receipts will always match your deposit when you auto close at midnight. To set this up, you're going to go to Company, Setup, Program Defaults tab, Daily Close. Once in the daily close, you have several options. It says automatic daily close will ensure that fiscal date reporting will equal calendar date reporting. Ledger adjustments must be made with a manual close. Requires one previous daily close to take effect. Normally, it's going to be set up as this. Do not use automatic daily close. You have two options. The first one is always perform an automatic daily close at midnight. Zero dollar close will be made if no payments exist. And perform an automatic daily close only when payments are made between midnight and the previous daily close. The difference between the two. If you choose the bottom option to perform an automatic daily close only when payments are made, it does just what it says. It will only close again at midnight if there was a payment online. The second option will have a close no matter what at midnight and if you don't have any payments from your previous close it will show a zero. It's my recommendation to choose the always perform an automatic daily close at midnight. Zero dollar close will be made if no payments exist. The reason why is if you choose the next option here to only close when there's payments that happen, sometimes you can question it and say, well, were there actually payments? Did it close or was it working properly? When you have the second option chosen, you're always going to see that close so you can be confident that it did in fact close. This third option works, uh, but in my experience, having the second option if you're going to do an automatic close is a better preference than the last option. So you click always perform an automatic daily close at midnight and then click OK to finalize and then you will start to have automatic closes at midnight every day.